I'm Coach White, the new PE teacher. Diaz, Diaz. Popular name where you guys come from? White. Is that a popular name where you come from? <laughs> All right, run a lap. Go. Walt Disney's Pictures, McFarland, USA, is a story of inspiration and the influence that two cultures have on each other when they meet. Disney Examiner was on the red carpet, and we talked to the artists that helped make this film, as well as the people that inspired the story. One of the real runners coached by Jim White talked to D.E. about the challenge that White put to him to compete in the Track City Classic and how that challenge helped shape his life. And that was over 30 years ago. And two years after that, when I was in eighth grade, he took me. Uh, and 30-some years later, I continue to coach that McFarland Track Club and take kids to that meet, and as well as out of the state of California three or four times during the year to compete at the national level. Screenwriter Grant Thompson told us about the story of the American dream and how that dream exists without color lines. The American dream is about working hard and putting one foot in front of the other long enough. It's not necessarily about whether you're a Latino or Asian or African American or anything else. And I think that, um, to me, hopefully this movie feels positive and like, hey, I'm going to work really hard, and that's the American way, and we're just seeing it in a fresh way uh, embodied by Latino actors. Actress Chelsea Rendon shared her thoughts on the status of Latin Americans in Hollywood today. Hey, well, all I got to say is Gina Rodriguez just won a Golden Globe. Jane the Virgin is doing great. We got Cristela on TV, and now with McFarlane and all these other projects, Latinos are coming up, and Latinas for sure. We're amazing. <laughs>